Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Benny Tong Crazy Marcus at it once again in town to Diane. Starting off it seems like they've reduced the seating on this. No it's I think it's cause the one side's open and not the other ain't. Bit weird, that. There is a sign on there. Um, I will try to have a look at the sign. We open Wednesday, I think. I thought today were Wednesday. Today's Wednesday, ain't it, Mikolas? Today's Wednesday. Oh. <laughs> Not more with the old homeless getting back out again as well. Um, you will, f I have found that lately, actually, a lot of places are shutting up for winter now. <laughs> and actually not really opening till, like, late Christmas time, that sort of right through coming up to the end of December. Now, I don't know why, I mean, December in Benidorm is a busy month, so you'd have thought businesses would want to stay open, but Maybe they know some that we don't. Maybe like businesses shutting early up until like a few days before Christmas is implying some Hopefully nothing bad, but you never know. Some of the shops over here there are Getting ready for Christmas, candy shop Diana there with a Christmas display. Um, noticing a few more places are getting Christmas trees put up now as well. Um, so I have seen a local estate agents and um, the lawn track down the road from where we live. Fernandez there. Still need to try that, but what puts me off is the fact that quite often you see flies walking over the food, so yeah. Plaza Mare there. I think I'll maybe cut through here for a try. Got a nice little shopping plaza. Got Avenida there, your perfume shop. Don't just have tons of clothes shops, nice jumpers, shirts, stuff like that. Just tons of nice sort of different shops really in this little area. So it gives a shelter from the Christ in the town as well. Then when you do come out, then you do have the leather shop just there. The um, cheap shop just there, like lots of buffers on. Then just come down to one. You do have a little restaurant just there. La Majorna. Spanish restaurant. You do have a skateboard shop there as well if you're into your skateboarding period. This absolutely awesome bench done at a snowboard. Awesome. Then, not a restaurant down there. Probably one of Benny Tom's busiest. 
ones, but as you can see as well, there are apartments in there. Got a lot actually, um, I've only just noticed that. Nice little beautiful area actually. Gonna carry on through to the other end now. Through to the other side. Head down towards where it comes out on Thomas Ortuno. Just tons of lot different shops. Got lot like, of sort of antique type store there, selling ornaments and stuff as such. Just tons of stuff, guys. Then finally. Coming right up to the end, you will eventually come back out on Thomas Ortuno. Directly opposite the food hall, also known as the um, Spanish Indoor Market. Nice little sportswear shop. Dante seems to be selling lots of different football shirts, even some sort of rare limited edition ones. Mm. Then just heading down Thomas or Tuna, you will come back out onto your main part of town. Got the new scene just there. And the shop on the corner has a bit of history to it. It is actually the Chinese shop that the Oracle pays a visit to in Benidorm when he's um, looking to buy a hat for his date with Leslie. If any of you remember that scene that were actually filmed here. Not exactly this shop. But not where the shop is, they have changed hands now, sadly. But still a good souvenir shop. Shirt shop there. Don't really do big sized shirts. And Sephora Espana. Traditional Spanish streets. Hotel International as well, uh, another hotel black bang in Benidorm, offering a buffet, twelve ninety five, or you can eat Mediterranean buffet, restaurant with a private terrace, and you get whatever wine included in the price. I mean, I'm assuming a Mediterranean buffet will probably be more like your seafood, your fish, um, sort of stuff like that, seafood, paella, swordfish, even. So yeah, but probably worth it. We're at a shop in Benidorm, <laughs> selling a lot of different stuff. BB guns, bollocks of it in there as well. Can't remember I know you still have one of them. And finally just coming back down into El Che Park, part of town now. El Che Park of course being one of the nicest areas of Benidorm in my opinion. Got one of the local well-known faces in Benidorm just over there outside the restaurant. 
believe his name's Billy. No cuss up a street busker. Always a good laugh. And um, finally, here we are at Old Chai Park. And it is busy as usual with the doves. You can actually feed them. Even though there are multiple signs saying not to feed them. So it is a bit of a controversial topic there, but... You can feed them, they are very gentle, they will sit on you and it's, it just makes for a great sort of picture to win them be a holiday by, like a load of dust sat on you. So thanks for watching today's video guys. I'll try and get him in, there he is. They are cute guys, they are so cute. Anyway guys, make sure to smash that like, smash subscribe, and as always, it's another day in the office. It's another day in paradise, and as always, what a paradise it is. Can't beat it. Adios guys.